How can children's literature empower the next generation to take action on social issues, health and sustainability? Karima El Khori, the United Nations Resident Coordinator in Malaysia, Brunei and Singapore, discusses the potential of reading and the importance of including messages of hope in books for children. We think of memory, of what we are shaping today in terms of uh, trying to inculcate a sense of empathy, curiosity, imagination, because they will need all these skills to build the future, then to what extent can we really put that also in a context where they could do something about it? And I think knowledge is power, the responsibility of educators, the responsibility of teachers, of parents, the responsibility of younger brothers and sisters, of older brothers and sisters, in really building that. So a book that has those you know, values, but also gives hope and agency, because children will build tomorrow's future, whether we like it or not. So let's give them the tools and make sure that literature contributes to that. Meanwhile, Lo Keming of Teach for Malaysia proposed enhancing access to literature through reading skills. Um, so in a recent interview with uh, Andres Schleicher, who is, is one of the directors at OECD that runs the assessment, he was mentioning a lot about uh, Malaysian context. You know, there, there are a lot of resources. So we do have uh, libraries in every school. We have reading corners. Uh, um, but I think one of the main things he was thinking about is how do we empower um, communities and teachers to really be focusing earlier and starting younger, right? And so to start younger, uh, if, if you reach a school age of maybe six or seven, uh, if you're not able to read at that level, you're actually already behind. Uh, and, and that's where the struggle is for a lot of students in urban poor communities. Uh, so I think that uh, focusing on the fundamentals is definitely something that we should be thinking about. I think Malaysia has the potential, uh, both um, you know, students that can internationally competitive, but also we do have a threshold that we need to uh, ensure we, we raise the floor in terms of reading comprehension and literacy as well.